Hey Sean, good radio pub. And the hunt is here today. That's right, this is the third, I think this is the third. The fourth. And your hunt from Madrid. So it sets, out, it sets out from here, yeah. It sets out from here, it goes out around Collins Wood and out around uh, the old cattle mark down that country and back in again at about half or five yeah, o'clock. Yeah. And it's a sort of Mayo hunt, hunt it's usually, isn't it? It's got to be the local one here for this area, wouldn't it? Yeah? Well, yeah, this time, they have only started in the last few years here. Like, yeah, you know, yeah. They've only gone, they've only gone from Carol Holly, one gone from the King, mm. one um, in Ahagawa, one in Morris. Yeah. And one nearly every week from now until, uh, I think it's February or March. February or March, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's, that's good old entertainment, I'd say. It looks like there'll be about 40 or 50 of them out there today, maybe more. I think there'll be about 50 or 60 turn up. Yeah, yeah. It's a good turnout if the weather keeps up. There wouldn't be good drinkers in for this, though, no? No, no, no. <laughs> Just a few warm meals, you know, before we go. And a couple of to come back as well. Tell me yeah. this, how long is this pub here, anyway? Uh, 1945, 71 years. 71, 45. Yeah. Father started here in 1945, and he got married in 1946, and the mother moved in here with him then. Yeah. And what was so, here before that? This must be an old building, isn't it? It was closed down at the time, it was belonged to the McNally's. Originally, you know, Joe McNally, from the present, his parents. Owned it. Joe, did he? Yeah. There was two different premises. One was here, you're standing in one of them, with the wall there dividing them. One was Jack McNally's parents and the other one was Joe McNally's. Oh, okay. So they bought it back then and they had closed down, they'd gone out of business. And were they businesses or were they...? It was a pub and a harbour, same as what oh, they did the pub, yeah. Version, just like what they had when they started up. And to the different uh, building than it is now? Oh, it is, For yeah. well, 30 years ago, yeah. I changed from the harbour in December 94, yeah. and then I got to the whole building in 97, and I put a restaurant upstairs and two apartments up in the, in the top story. There's a great farmer's pub down there. So, there's a great farmer's pub. You can buy anything here from there. You, you, you can buy a spade here or a uh, uh, bought for myself. A bought for myself. A bought for A bought for myself. A bought for myself. A bought for myself. A bought for Lots of different things. You see, did you have any groceries? Did you have no, any groceries? Oh, mainly hardware. My father would deal with that side of it, the, the farming implements, and my mother used to deal with the souvenirs and the dead. So it was great, a place to buy for wedding presents and stuff like that. You know, my mother. And when they were in it, it was this side, like this is the, they had it together. Yeah, it was yeah. out in there, over there, near yeah. close to the window. Yeah. This was part of the private residence. Oh, they, they lived in here. Yeah. So, yeah, we lived overhead. I was born yeah. and reared up here. Mm. Your father was an icon in the town longer, wasn't he? He was, he was what? He was a big farmer's man. Right? He was a no, farmer, he was, and he was a farmer yeah, himself? He was a farmer, bought a farmer land out where I live now, out in uh, the West Road, in Carnal mm -hmm. And he had more time for the, the land than he did for the crop. He loved the land. <laughs> loved the land. Yeah. A bit like Paul McCabe. <laughs> when I built my house on the land, the first day the machine went in, he told me I was after ruining a good farmer land. Right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, the book business has changed in your time, has it? has changed, yeah. The smoking area, the drink drive, oh, it has all changed. Like, but, but still, like Westport, we're in a big town in Westport. Like, there's a lot of pubs per head of capita, like, but still, there's enough for everybody in it. But well, you get enough of tourists here, don't you? Yeah, well, tourists is a big thing, like, you know, and Allegan is a big help. Yeah, yeah. You know, but mainly tourists, the weekend is a very good social town. You know, and we have a lot of hotels, there's nine or ten hotels, I think, so that brings in. Do you get the stags coming in? We get the stags and the hens. Yeah. How do you find them anyway? All right, uh, no, so far, so good. No, they're, usually good. Ago, they're usually a bit of crack, aren't they? Years ago, they were rough enough, but now they're not. They <laughs> mellowed a bit now. And there's, in fairness to the guards, they're keeping, you know, they're always on hand on a Saturday night, especially if there's any bit of a hassle at all, they're a bit, bit nipped in the mud, so mm. that's a great help. Think of the Wild Atlantic Way have you anything here? Or oh, oh, the Greenway, yeah? The Greenway is big. Wouldn't be, wouldn't be big drinkers that have come, but like, you know, this to think out of the box, they go off and recommend the town to other people, so might, people that might be interested in having a few drinks and that, but when they're cycling you can't expect them to drink it. No, no, no. We don't do the food here in the bar, but the bars that are doing the food will be doing well. Mm -hmm. and, especially on the continent, you know, but it's all positive. So were you born in the Mad here, you were? No, I, li I lived in the Mad until I got married in 1985. And you moved out the country then? Moved out the country. You went out and ruined a good farm? Ruined a good farm in <laughs> the land, as my father said. <laughs> But I love it. It's just outside the town. It's only a mile and a half, like you know. So I'm not too far out. Well, this this uh, hunt is a great spectacle here with the autumn leaves and the horses and the dogs and the whole lot. All the different colours of the, the leaves yeah. and the mallets. Fantastic. Yeah. 